This road is spectacular. It is. We're Matt and Nat, a travel couple based out of Nashville, Tennessee. After having our world turned upside down in 2020, we decided to set out on our biggest adventure yet, to see all 50 states in a year. In our last video, we were in Vermont, where we enjoyed all things fall at Cold Hollow Cider Mill, took in the picturesque sights of the quaint town of Stowe, and spent a beautiful evening exploring the city of Burlington. This week, we're in the Granite State. Welcome, Welcome to, to New, New Hampshire. Hampshire. Today is going to be a little bit more of a scenic road trip day. We're going to be driving the Kankamagas Highway, which is one of the most scenic highways in the Northeast. It is a 56 mile drive, but we're only doing a 35 mile section of it from Lincoln to Conway. But first, let's get started with a great local breakfast spot. So this place is kind of like a takeout only kind of place. There was a really long line, so we just ordered online. <laughs> Both got the Asiago bagel, but Natalie got what the lox spread. I got the lox cream cheese spread, and I got bacon egg and cheese. Also, I switched up my drink order a little bit today. Yeah. Natalie, you can guess, got chai latte, and I got a dirty chai, which is a chai with an espresso shot in it. Cheers! Oh my god, that's so hot. Mm, that's good. It burned my mouth. Yeah, it is hot, but it's good. Ugh. The Asiago bagel, so good. It has a lot of flavor. I love the salmon. I like that they didn't scramble the eggs. It's like a fried egg with the blessed yolk. Mm, the bacon's good too, it's kind of smoky. What? The ambiance leaves a little to be desired, but. Mm -hmm. But here's a really cool train. Mm -hmm. So I don't like coffee, like at all. I just, I can't do it. <laughs> but. I don't like the taste. I, I introduced her to chai tea years ago, and now she loves it. So maybe a dirty chai will be her baby step. It smells like baby coffee. Baby step into coffee world, maybe. Just try a little bit. Yeah, no. Are you serious? It tastes too much like coffee. Yeah. Are you serious? Yeah, I'm serious. I tried, guys. Oh, that's so much better. <laughs> that was really good. It really was. It was the perfect way to get our day started. Let's go. Take one. <laughs> Here we go. road is spectacular. It is. I hope you can tell on video and photos how vibrant the colors are because they are beautiful. It's magnificent. This is phenomenal. It We're really at a is. really quick pit stop. And yep, it said, I think you say Sabaday Falls. I think that's how it said. But it's a half a mile hike, so here we go.
beautiful. And if you're ever on the scenic highway, definitely worth a stop. Absolutely. And if you've ever been to the New England area in the fall, comment below with your suggestions so we can try them out next time. Also, while you're there, hit that thumbs up button if you like this video because it helps out our channel so much. Also consider subscribing because it's free and it would mean the world to us. <laughs>
but you're here too. <laughs> So we just finished our two and a half hour train ride and it was so much fun. It really was. We loved it, had a great time. I will say this train ride is more about the ride itself and the history you learn on the ride than it is about any big spanning views, but the foliage totally made it so worth it. So worth it. As you guys know, I had a snack on the train and I am hungry, so. <laughs> and I didn't have a snack, so I am more hungry. <laughs> Let's go eat. Pro tip, make sure you make reservations for yourself or any kind of food if you're anywhere in New England because everywhere <laughs> has like a 45 minute wait. Yeah, we typically don't travel during any kind of peak season. Yeah. Um, for this one, obviously we are because it is peak foliage here in New England, so. Crazy. Um, yeah, so I think we're gonna have to call an audible. We don't have time to wait like an hour to get a table at a restaurant, so. And then eat on top of that because the sun's gonna set, yeah, we're so. Tr we're trying to get to a nice sunset spot, so. We'll see what happens. Fast food it is. That sucks. Yeah, that sucks. Bad. Oh well, let's do it. So if this is your first time watching us, this is not what we do. Okay, we always eat local. We love local. Yep. But we just don't have time for local. Yeah, um, we're having to go against everything <laughs> within us. And we're going to Chipotle, which I love, <laughs> but still not cool in New England. But the reason why we came here is there is no line. So let's go. Also, that whole not eating fast food chains when you're traveling goes out the window when it's in and out. So. <laughs> So don't come for him is what he's trying to say. So scratch that, yes. uh, they close at three Drive today. Drive two for Conway on their dining situation. Matt is so annoyed. Um, beyond annoyed. Uh, we were already uh, stooping to a new level having to eat fast food while we're traveling. And now we're having to stoop to another level because the only options we have right now are McDonald's, Taco Bell, Subway, or Dairy Queen. Yeah. Unless we want to wait like an hour for a table. I'm so annoyed. Okay. Well, we won't be filming our fast food review. So. No, we'll see you when we get back to the fun stuff. Okay. <laughs> Somebody is in a better mood now. Yeah, <laughs> that's all I got to say. I was not in a good mood. Taco Bell hit the spot. <laughs> But now we're about to go get back on the Kankamagas Highway because we only had about two hours earlier to do everything that we wanted to do and it just wasn't enough time. So if you're gonna do it, we highly recommend spending three to four hours to drive it between Lincoln and Conway. Do you know that they call us leaf lookers, leaf peepers? I know, I'd never heard it called leaf I peepers. had never either until we got one of these little brochures. It tells you all the different leaves. Sorry, Matt. <laughs> All the different leaves. It's got really cool map in here. So if you're ever here, you need to pick one of these autumn brochures up. And comment below if you already knew that it was called leaf peepers. It just sounds creepy, but yeah. I like it. Peeping Let's go. feels a lot <laughs> worse than looking. Let's go peep some leaves. <laughs> Look how big these leaves are. Comment below if you want it and I will give it to you. It might not look like this in the mail. It might be crumply and in a bunch of pieces. But it's awesome. <laughs> now we're off to try to find a vista or viewpoint to watch the sunset from. We'll see. We made it. Just barely. <laughs> Like in our 
Vermont video, these fall sunsets come way too quickly. <laughs> but we loved getting to explore New Hampshire and all of the beautiful fall foliage, and we're excited to continue our New England adventures in state number 44 in our next video. We'll see you guys then. Guys, my hat takes up so many trees. <laughs> Get out yeah, of here. Get New New Hampshire. <laughs> what? Got some friends over here. Nearby. Come on, get it together. No. You silly oh, rascal, stop, you. <laughs> Kankamawis Highway, take one. Kankamawis. Kankamawis. Good choice. Well, it was pretty much our only choice. So, <laughs> so now we're gonna go back to the Kankamawis. I don't know how to say it. So the question I ask is, are we viral yet? Obviously, the answer is. I think we might be because it's taking a long time to load all of the new subscribers and views. Or the V of no service. It does say something's not right, which I would probably feel that way if we had a whole lot of new subscribers and views. Like, mm, something's not right. Or they said there's a deer. This is what a hero looks like, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Recording, yeah.